The first five things you should do with your new computer. Don't forget these important first steps after getting a new PC. Update your anti-malware program. The last thing you want to do is get your brand new computer infected with malware. Who wants that? I thought about calling this install an anti-malware program but almost all computers come with one pre-installed. Windows 10 comes with Microsoft's own tool built in so most PCs are ready to go. Here's the thing, though, it won't be updated. Probably not, anyway. So, after setting it up, head to the scanner settings and update the definitions, the instructions that teach the program how to identify and remove new viruses, trojans, worms, etc. Tip, like I mentioned above, new Windows computers this year will have basic antivirus protection, but it's not the best. Install available Windows updates. Yes. I know, you'd think your brand new computer would be fully updated but chances are it won't be. Microsoft releases security and non-security updates to Windows on at least a monthly basis, oftentimes more frequently than that. See how to install Windows updates if you've never done this and need help. Tip, the Windows Update tool is pre-configured to download and install updates automatically. While this is generally a good thing. It can be a bit overwhelming of a thing to happen in the background during the first few hours of using your new computer. Install a file recovery program. This one might surprise you. Why install a program to help recover accidentally deleted files if you haven't even used your computer yet, let alone lost something? Here's why. The big catch 22 about file recovery programs is that you often have to install one before you can use it a process which could permanently overwrite the area on the hard drive where your deleted file is sitting. That's not the risk you want to take. Sign up for an online backup service. Yep, another proactive step here, one you'll be thanking me for some day. Online backup services are combination software tools and subscription services that automatically keep what data you want protected on secure servers away from your home or business. In my opinion, an online backup service is the best or and most cost-effective long-term solution to keeping your data safe. Uninstall programs you don't want. You may already have noticed that your computer came with a lot of, well, let's just say extra software. In theory, leaving these programs installed won't hurt much if anything, aside from taking up a bit of hard drive space. In reality, many of these pre-installed programs run in the background. Hagging up memory and processor power that you'd rather use for other things. My advice? Head into control panel and get those programs removed.